The man went so far as to take off his wife's stockings in front of everyone. He wanted to show his brothers his wife's marvelous body. However, she rejected him on the spot, which made the husband feel humiliated. So when his friends had left, he began to teach his wife a lesson. He asked his wife to please herself. He had already entered two years in jail, so how could his wife, who was eight months pregnant, oblige him and happen to be seen by her son, who has autism? And the woman comforted him so that the child would not be afraid. Promise. The woman thought that her husband would change after his time in jail. However, he was dead set against it, and it must be said that there are only zero and countless times when it comes to things like domestic violence. As a boxer, he never beat anyone but called his wife over and over again. The woman couldn't take it anymore and chose to call the police. However, the police expressed a difficult situation. The police thought that this was their family matter, that the police department could not control. At most, they could only give her husband a small warning. Upon returning home, the man is furious when he learns of the situation, saying that the police warned him in front of his brothers and that this has brought him into disrepute. The woman taunted that what else would she do but beat her wife? A comment that drove her husband to anger. A man burned a woman's breast with a cigarette and his wife was left screaming to teach his wife a lesson. This time the man went so far as to lock her in her room in front of her son. Yet even though she was forbidden, the woman continued to comfort her son. Your dad's playing a game, Mickey. It's like a pirate game. We're pretending he's gone away to sea and he's put me in a prison. As the seconds ticked by, her husband did not return. So she asked her son to go to the kitchen get a knife and pointed at him through the doorway. He took the knife and poked the lock of the door so hard that the woman's stomach ached from the sheer force. He was about to give birth. Well, at last, he pried the door open. The mother and child arrived at the hospital. The midwife saw this and immediately took the woman in. However, the baby's head has already come out partially. At this time, do not deliver the mother and the child will be life running. So they casually brought a towel and spread it on the floor. And they tried to deliver the woman in C2. When they saw the wound on the woman's chest, they understood everything. But the most important thing at this point was to make sure the mother and child were safe. The baby was born under the doctor's guidance. And because it had been delayed for so long, the child's airway was blocked with feces. The doctor immediately brought a catheter, inserted it into the child's airway, and finally cleared the feces from the baby's airway, and the child was finally out of danger. After returning home on the second day, the wife locked the door behind her. She felt that her husband would only bring them harm. However, the husband directly smashed the glass window with his bare hands and even threatened that he would not let the woman go. The woman wanted to divorce her husband, yet he refused her. She just wanted to torture her slowly. The woman had no choice but to find her mother and cry about her ordeal. However, the mother felt that it was not normal for husbands to beat their wives. That's how she came to be. This left the woman helpless and speechless. At one point she wanted to commit suicide, but she couldn't do it when she thought of her child. In the end, the midwife's office couldn't stand it anymore, and they helped the woman testify that her husband was violent. In the end, the woman managed to divorce her husband and get custody, leaving a place that only brought her pain.